What shall I put in my story today? Oh, it's a chilly day. So, I'll start with that. One. Chilly. Chilly. And then I'll draw the river with my two blue pens like this. And I'll put this picture of the boat on my drawing to show the place. And now I'll be on my way. Now, where shall I look for a story today? Oh, that's dangerous. I wonder who left that there. I could have fallen in the water or banged my head. I'd better put this out of harm's way. And now I'll set off. says there's a place not far from here where I can see new bricks being made. See if I can find out how bricks are made now. My goodness, it's muddy here. I mean, somebody doing an awful lot of digging. I wonder what this has got to do with making bricks. I think I'll go and see if I can find out. Yes, certainly what we do here is take the clay out of the ground, 
Well, that's where I got stuck in it when I was walking. That's right, yes. Uh-huh. And we're moving it to the machine by the tractor, uh-huh. where we will squash it down, and that's what we make the bricks from. cement to stick the bricks together and you can build anything you like. That's it. That's wonderful. Anyway, thank you very much for showing me around. Pleasure. Thank you. you. Bye. Bye. Rosie, look how high my 
you're going to build with that brick. <laughs> One chilly day, Rosie and Jim saw three pigs in a field. Hello, called Jim. I know, said Rosie, you must be the three little pigs. Don't build a straw house, said Jim. The wolf will blow it down, said Rosie. Or one of sticks, said Jim. How do you know, said the pigs. We've read the story, said Jim. Use bricks, said Rosie. Well, we haven't got any bricks, said the pigs. We'll get you some, said Rosie. Rosie and Jim ran to the brickworks. They borrowed a wheelbarrow and bought some bricks with their pocket money. Then they ran all the way back. You can use our bricks, said Rosie and Jim. They helped the three little pigs to build a house of bricks. When the wolf came, he huffed and he puffed, but he couldn't lie it down. Told you so, said Rosie. 